Hi guys, it's Isla. Uh, back with an unboxing of my November 2015 Orange Glad Sweet Treat Box. Now, this is a food subscri dessert subscription that's $31 a month for a double treat, and that's what I have here. You can get, I think, $15 for a single treat, so you get one of each item. I have two in this one. Um, this is a different... It's the same box as normal, just that different coloring of print. Usually it's orange, not pale white. So let's open it up. <laughs> so here is all my items. You get a little small magazine telling you about the bakeries and about the foods. This box is full. So let's get started. Okay, the first item we have is from Dottie's Delights not Dottie's Delight. It says right here Delight. I added the S because Dottie Delight is a lingerie company. <laughs> so Dottie's Delight is the bakery that makes the maple caramel, uh, the maple caramels. And they're very lovely packaged. Uh, <laughs> they're really nicely packaged. Um, since I have two of these, it's four ounces, and that is a full size unit. So each, if you got a single box, it'd be a, a half of a full. Um, but since I got two, I have a full. How do I open this? <laughs> um, so I, so this is these two are worth six dollars. I'm gonna have to take off the picture, aren't I? Oh, you're supposed to, that's why. Okay. These are made with plenty of real maple syrup. This extra rich and buttery caramel is one of them I are most popular with good reason. So they come packaged like that. It smells like maple syrup. <laughs> These are really, really good. Uh -huh. They did. They taste mapley, but the caramel flavor comes through. Also, they are really, really good. <laughs> Next, we got an item from Shotwell Candy Company. These are Tennessee Toffees. I have two packages. And so full size is 2.5 ounces, which is both of these together. So this is $5.95 right here. Uh, what does it say? It's made by slow cooking butter and pure cane sugar until that perfect golden color is achieved. Adding a splash of barrel aged bourbon and a handful of fresh roast pecans and then the finishing it off with a covering of premium 60% cocoa dark chocolate. Just a hint of crunchy sea salt. Okay, I'm having a hard time getting into these things. Okay. So. Okay, this is what this looks like. Um... It does have a stronger smell. I haven't had coffee in a while. I meant toffee in a while. <laughs> so. Mm. Well. The flavor is good, but I'm not a toffee person. I don't like the hardness and the fact that it kind of gets right on top of your teeth and just stays there. So I'm probably going to give the rest to either my parents, probably not because they have dentures, probably my coworkers. Um, but it does taste great, just that I'm not a toffee person because the texture that leaves in your mouth and then it gets in your teeth. Next, we have. Uh, from Poisoned Apples, 
Um, that's the bakery. Uh, we have crunchy toffee topped caramels, and they're in heart shapes. Uh, so a full size is uh, six of these for $14. I have two, so that's $4.67. So this is a gourmet spin on a classic Twix candy bar. Each caramel starts with a buttery crisp shortbread cookie and then comes a heap of smooth, creamy, buttery, rich caramel. And finally the top is scrumptious top crunch toffee. Oh, messy, 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 melty, melty. <laughs> Taste exactly like a Trix bar, but with more shortbread. All that white is the shortbread. But, damn, this is good. Mmm. <laughs> So far, really great items. <laughs> yeah, let me get a wipe for my hands. I just got this today and it's already starting to melt. It's probably just my room. Okay, next we have something from my neck of the woods. We have Seattle's Chocolates. Uh, thanks a lot. Milk chocolate and truffle bar. I have two of these. And these are full size, so I have two of them, so that's $7. Um, these are crafted with creamy milk chocolate and a melt away center, and is loaded with English hard toffee, lots of gratitude, and a dash of sea salt. And these are non GMO and gluten free. So this is what the bar looks like. Wow, that's a big piece. It's very, very smooth chocolate. Um, with a little bit of crunch from the toffee. Not, not enough to really notice you're eating toffee. You just notice a crunch. You don't know what it's from unless you read the ingredients. Um, and the sea salt, it's very, very little and it does add a nice contrast flavor. So those are really good. Um, but it tastes sort of like a normal chocolate bar. Better than Hershey's though. So, happy with that. And the last but not least, we have from Stud Muffin Desserts. Uh, let's put all this stuff away. We have Bleecker Street Brittle. Uh, so I have basically two pieces. Um, now, I have no idea how much my samples cost because a full size is $10 for a small. And I don't know what a small size is. So this is, now you can taste the chic sweetness of the West Village's cobblestone bleaker street in this buttery, crunchy, nutty bleaker street brittle. All natural, gluten free, and handsome, oh, sorry, handmade from stud muffin desserts, original recipe. It is deliciousness of the highest quality true to bleaker street. So, warning, I'm not a big peanut brittle fan, but it looks nice. A lot of peanuts. a good taste very chock full of peanuts you can totally taste the flavor of peanut um, just for my taste it's way too hard <laughs> I can barely eat it 
Um, so overall, this um, month's value, well, total retail is about twenty four sixty two. I added a dollar for those two peanut brittles because of I don't know how much is a ten. <laughs> I mean, how much is a small for ten dollars? So overall, I am very happy with the um, salted toffee. Um, I love the maple caramels. Um, and I like the Sal's Chocolates Bar. Um, just that it tastes almost like a plain chocolate bar. I'm not a big fan of plain chocolate bars. Um, the peanut brittle is too hard and so is the Tennessee toffee. But the flavors are good. Just that for me the texture was too hard. So overall this was a nice box this month. I really enjoyed uh, a lot of the items and a lot of chocolate this time. <laughs> I love chocolate. <laughs> so anyway, thank you for watching. Bye.